Were you out to Notre Dame and some other guys? What you saw? I uh, saw a lot out there. Obviously, they did a ton of different stuff. Um, obviously, it might have been a little bit confusing for us right there going into halftime. Um, you know, a little bit disappointed. Feel like we left a lot out there, um, but you know, we started to pick it up towards the end. Uh, compared to Notre Dame, you know, not really too many similarities other than, like I said earlier, that they're just good athletes. Um, you know, they're two gappers. They just like to sit there and hold you and try and make a giant wall, so you can't really run. Um, but Deshaun just did a great job of, you know, staying in the pocket, taking a couple of hits, and just delivering dimes all night. So it was really awesome to see. What do you guys think when you see Deshaun take a hit like he did? I took Yeah, it kind of hurts you as an offensive lineman. Um, you know, sometimes it's not our fault, but we always take credit for it. Um, and we just try to get better at the play. Can you put into perspective what Mitch has accomplished in playing a half a season? He sure has looked like a freshman out there. No doubt. Um, you know, this guy's having all American numbers, I think. Um, you know, he's dominated almost every game he's played in. Um, you know, tonight was really the first night that he was confused ever in a game. Um, but, you know, that's um, obviously something that's going to grow and make him a lot better. Um, you know, facing such a great defense, number one in a ton of categories. Um, you know, he did very well. So. Has he, have you seen his confidence grow as the years going along? No and he kind of come in with some of that, uh, that swagger? Well, you know, he's, he's just a smart kid, um, obviously very talented, so he had that confidence a little bit already. Um, but, you know, as he grows and grows in the offense and just, you know, keeps getting confident, you know, his confidence on the field is just erupting right now. Obviously, it's one of the top defenses in a lot of different categories. They, I think the, the most yards that they've given up all season in a single game was 228 against the Y'all there. Yeah. What does that speak not just about one category, not just about the run game, not just about the pass game, but for you as an offensive player? Um, you know, I think it's just awesome for us to have accomplished that. Uh, 534 yards, I think. You know, they were averaging 140. Um, so, you know, when you can multiply something by that by five um, to their average, you know, that's awesome. And, you know, it was, wasn't our best game. You know, we left a lot out there. Um, Deshaun got hit a lot more than we wanted to. Um, you know, the running game didn't get as started as we wanted to, but that's tough. We're going to grow on us and make us a better team because of that. Did you have to kind of change the offensive philosophy coming into tonight just because you knew that, that they were going to stop the run? Um, when you talk about in regards to the entire season, yes. Um, but we didn't change during the game. We knew that we were going to throw uh, all over them just because that's what they gave. You. And, uh, you know, we weren't going to be dumb and try and run the ball against a great run defense. Um, but we took it when it was there. I think we made, a, you know, a couple of really nice run plays when we needed to. Um, and, you know, it was just a great execution by our part. Five of the last six games have been at home. Now you're finally yeah, going on a little road trip. Going on a little road trip, yeah. <clears throat> what, is, what, what is that, uh, what kind of philosophy do you have as a player? Going on, it's just it's just excited to go see other places, man. We we haven't been to Miami in a long time. Um, this is going to be our first group that has been down there, and I think you know maybe five years since I've been here, we haven't been down there. Um, you know, it's going to be fun. It's going to be different. Um, we're going to have to play on the road. You know, bring our own juice, bring our own stuff. Cause, you know. Hopefully we're going to be winning those games. It's going to be quiet. So, um, you know, it's going to be a big adjustment for us. Is there going to be a little added motivation with so many guys from the state of Florida? I think definitely. When you play a team from Florida, having you know so many guys, we have such a good pipeline with the state of Florida, um, there's going to be a little extra pizzazz in this game, and we're really looking forward to it. 6-0 at the halfway point of the season. You feel good about where this team's at right now? Definitely. Um, you know, this is where we expect it to be. Like I told you all every Tuesday, man, um, you know, we're just a bunch of winners. That's what we do. Um, we're just excited where we are right now. What is, you know, going into the second half of the season, what are the biggest things you need to continue doing or improve on? Um, just keep being us. Um, you know, slowing the game down, I think, a couple of times during tonight. Uh, you saw it get away from us a little bit. Maybe we made a mental error here or there that, you know, could have been prevented if we just would have slowed it down. Um, but also at the same time, we got a tempo. You know, when we were tempo and flying around on those guys, you know, they couldn't do anything to our offense. So we really got to exploit that uh, when given the opportunity. To have point way, midpoint way in the season, what do you know about yourselves? Um, obviously, I think the offensive line is one of the strong points of this team. Um, you know, our running game, strong point. It's just the overall collectiveness of this team is something that we haven't had. You know, we've been great on defense, great on offense. You know, now we're a great team. And, you know, that's something that we really need to keep coming together. Um, I think we've been in a couple of adverse situations early that is really going to help us. Um, obviously in Louisville, playing down to the wire, Notre Dame playing down to the wire. Um, it's going to be games that really brought us together that's going to help this cohesion and just keep building on. you think this is the best Clemson team you've been on? That I've been on, definitely. Um, just the family feel that we have, you know, the general appreciation for everyone's job. Um, overall team, yes, I think this is the best team that we've had so far. Thanks, guys.